What's up YouTube? Now I'm gonna show you how to install uh, Pro Tools 10. Actually, this is uh, version 10.3. Um, I downloaded a torrent file uh, named uh, Jing Lui, Jing Lui, whatever. Uh, this is the file. Let me show you the file. Uh, this is the file. I downloaded it and I don't know what's wrong with it. Uh, it doesn't even have a readme file or patch or anything just the installer uh, I extracted it here and here are the files some files are hidden um, I'll show them uh, these are the files it doesn't have a, a readme file or uh, you know uh, any patch or anything uh, so if you have a if you have a torrent file like a torrent file like this um you need to download the patch uh there are two patches actually you need to download both of them and the license support uh i'll give you the links uh right down the video first of all download them uh i think i checked the torrent f uh, site uh two days after i downloaded this uh, after i download this file and there was a there was a crack and a readme file in the torn but uh, I don't know what's wrong with this uh, I couldn't even find this torn file after uh, two days uh, anyway if you don't have the patch uh, download this uh, patch and uh, license support uh, driver setup and I look client helper it's optional uh, and by the way, you can get more information about this torn file by uh, Kickstorn uh, web page, and check out the comments, and you get uh, lots of information about the torn file. Uh, to install this, uh, let's hidden the files as it was. Run the setup and set up. Uh, after the setup, uh, I set up it uh, to my uh, local disk, uh, C disk. Uh, I don't know if it's okay to uh, install into another location, another partition. But anyway, uh, you can figure it out. But I installed it to my C disk, my OS disk, main disk. Um, after the installation, uh, it installs. Um, some HD uh, drivers or something and it it may ask for a r restart go ahead and restart your PC and then install the Pro Tools 10 after the installation uh, it may ask for a restart again but don't restart go to your patch you can see the one, so, uh, this is a Pro Tools HD 10.3 patch uh, copy it and paste it to here uh, to your uh, Pro Tools 10 folder. It should be here, Avid Pro Tools. Copy it here, and uh, I have my copied file. Uh, 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 right here. Paste it here and double click and double click it, and it will do the work. It will patch. Then you need to uh, wait a minute. Okay, uh, you you can uh, you can find a notepad uh, inside this uh, protestant after team uh, VR patch, VR patch, whatever. Uh, read the notepad. Read the notepad, and um, it tells how to install. Pro Tools 10. Uh, install the Pro Tools 10 and apply the team via uh, VR Beta 7 patch as I told. Uh, copy it and double click it and open it and it will do the work. And then you need to apply the iLock license support which is uh, yeah, uh, this one. License support. It, uh, remember it won't give any uh, visual um, effect when you install it but uh, it will do its work uh, after that uh, you need to make sure I have the latest uh, release of uh, ACO for all driver 
I have it. Uh, if you don't have it, please install this your for all driver. <coughs> and then uh, you need this uh, Pro Tools uh, after Team VR patch. Uh, extract it somewhere and copy this uh, Pro Tools uh, .dll file to your installation folder. That means uh, I have it here. Program files, Avid Pro Tools. Uh, copy it and paste it here. Uh, yeah. Uh, then you can close it and <coughs> restart your PC. After the restart, uh, it should work. But uh, I must say that uh, the first time I installed Pro Tools 10, uh, there was an error uh, called uh, iLock authorization failed. Please insert the correct uh, blah blah blah. Uh, when you get this um, error message, it could be because uh, you haven't actually, if you haven't patched correctly, uh, that could be a problem. Because uh, the first time I installed this, I didn't patch it correctly. So I, at, at the moment, I got that message, and then I uh, uninstalled all the thing and reinstalled them and. I patched it as this notepad says and it worked and I also found a video on uh, YouTube uh, about this uh, iLock authorization problem and it says uh, he had a <coughs> uh, what's this doesn't matter uh, he, he says uh, he had a Bluetooth device um, in his uh, USB port and after he removed it, it worked. So uh, it, could be, it could be any reason, but uh, you need to figure it out oh, what's your problem. It, 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 I can't tell this is the real, this is the only solution for your problem. So uh, it could be patch or it could be that kind of... Uh, Bluetooth device problem. Anyway, um, but if you installed your Pro Tools 10 tone file as the way I told you, probably it should work. And I'll show you. Uh, I'm not sure I can run this right now because uh, I'm running Camtasia to. Uh, I don't know I I whether it would start or not, but. I'll try. But anyway, I have to end my video from here. Um, I'll try to show you. It works, right? No error. It works fine, but uh, I'm gonna end my video from here because it's gonna take a long, long time to load. Anyway, thank you. I uh, hope you can get work it out.